wondering what is happening here. Well, let's just say this is the start of a wicked time. I had done three months in the best rehabilitation the state of California had to offer. I was dependent on coke and opioids and wasn't going anywhere quickly. I had to make a change. I was looking for new highs, you could say. Along the way, I made some friends that shared similar interests. This is Danny. He's from Oakland and the only person I became close with when I was in there. He was addicted to heroin. That boy can stick a needle anywhere. He had a good attitude always and was ambitious. This is Chris. He just did a month in here for dropping that acid on the reg. We got close the last three weeks. He's not bad at basketball either. He's from Torrance. And I could tell he was ready for a fresh start. <laughs> Dude is funny as hell too. And right over here is Dylan. His country ass couldn't put down the grain alcohol. He's not bad. I wouldn't rule him out. Even with his constant negativity. Homie came over from Tennessee after his moonshine bar blew up and was court ordered three months. And last but not least, Jessica. She was a student at UCSB, on the dean's list, honor roll, chick had it made. The white showed up one night at a frat party and she gave it all away, never looked back. She could start a whole gram in one line if she wanted to. <laughs> I guess you could say we have similar backgrounds. So Jessica was one of the four girls here when I got here. She started recovery a week before I did. She decided to stay an extra month. Most people get out as quick as they can so they can get high and go back to the bad things. Not this girl. She had an agenda for new beginnings. And new beginnings were in store for us indeed. Dude, three months and six days. Two more days and we're out of here. Can you believe it? It feels right. Yeah, it feels right for now. Until the bills come around and you have no job. <laughs> I might not have anything yet, but you can bank on me making bank when I get out of here. Yeah, we'll see about that. What about you, Jess? Planning on selling yay again? I'm just playing. I have a job lined up, actually. My aunt just opened up a tanning salon, so I'll be doing that. I figure, why not? It's a good place to start. Maybe take a couple classes. That's sad. At least you got something going on. Me? I think I might just go back to selling herb or something. <laughs> yeah, and end up right back here. No, I don't got a problem with that. It's that other shit I'd rather do. What about you, Tom? What are you doing after this? Not a regular job, that's for sure. That's what I'm saying, man. For your herb, whatever. You sell some herb, I can sell some herb. Like I said, I don't got a problem with that shit. <laughs> nah, something bigger than herb, man. I don't want to get involved with drugs again. Well, what are you thinking then? Seems like you got something on your mind. Nothing. Uh, there's nothing. I, he's in. They're all in. I think it's a sealed deal. You can't let his emotions get in the way of this. I know he's your best buddy, but you can't give him special treatment. Hmm. Why have I heard this before? Okay, same goes for you. Okay, as soon as you start slipping, I'm out. Girl, you know my head's in a good spot. <laughs> I think we should get a home. Another one? I know we're almost at capacity, but it's still way too early to expand. I'm not talking about another modeling agency. I'm talking about you and I. <clears throat> Business couldn't have been any better right now, and Danny has 50 girls in rotation, making a couple hundred bucks a night. How does he have 50 girls in rotation if there's only 15 beds? About that. I've been waiting for a good time to bring this up, but we went ahead and bought out a fleet of condos down in Irvine. We bought 10 units all in a row, so none of the neighbors will complain. Each unit has three bedrooms, each bedroom with two beds, and with the 15 beds at the beach house, that's 75 in total. 
We're averaging 200K a week. Everything should work out perfectly. Tony, are you serious? Take a look for yourself. This is fucking nuts, Tony. How are we supposed to keep track of 75 women? All right, so this is the website that I've made for us. Okay. I'm digging it, dude. It's nice. Yeah, I like the picture of the condos right there, the layout. Yeah. Cool, man. I like that location. That's a good location. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Thanks. Nice and safe. Um, what does that tab do right there? All right, so on this tab you click and you can see the rates for the girls. Okay. How much they cost, subscriptions, memberships, all of that jazz. Fuck yeah, dude. This thing about the background check too, right? Yeah. Solid. So it's good. Feels good with it. Yeah, dude, I'm liking that. Yeah. Sure. Um, what about the cash breakdown? Cash breakdown. So we go to employment. Right here. You can see how it's being distributed. Right now we have 17.8 towards security. Is that good? We agree on that? 17.8. Yes, Dylan. 17.8. Yeah. I'm guessing that's not what you like. Shh. I want 18%. Dude, fuck your 18%. I want 18%. Why the fuck do you need 18%? Why the fuck not? Dude, you guys aren't even doing their fucking jobs. We are doing our jobs. Dude, you said it the other day yourself. How many of these girls have been fucking relapsing? Yeah, yeah dude. dude. You want me to tell them to do their jobs? That's yeah. what you want from me. Go and actually fucking check All on right, the girls. Well, how, Keep about them I, how about I tell you what I want from you? What? I want a horse. That's it? You want a fucking horse? What the fuck do you need a horse for? I want a horse. Okay, if he wants a horse and he'll get the job done, that sounds... Look, I don't want any cops coming after me, okay? If I get a horse, it's a fast get. So you're just gonna be like this, aren't you? Tony, I can't even fucking talk to you right now. You know, every time I try to tell you something, you always have this fucking attitude. I just don't understand. Attitude? Yeah. God, you're unbelievable. <laughs> oh, I'm unbelievable. Yeah, you yeah, are. Really? Yeah. You know, I know we started this idea together, but ever you together? know- Together? Yeah. What do you mean, not together? Yeah, not together. What do you mean? God, you think you could so, just think we're still together and we're <laughs> sleeping, you're sleeping with all oh, these other people? I'm sleeping with other people? I didn't say anything like that. First of all, you know that we've had a thing since the beginning. And now you want to act like mm, this ain't shit? Yeah, Come on, it girl. Ain't. You know I'm not trying to keep lies to you. I'm just waiting for the perfect time sometimes Shut to up. tell you. Shut <laughs> up! Is that funny? Fuck you! Listen, hear me out. I don't mean to keep you in the dark, all right? I'm sorry I didn't tell you what needed to be said. I'm sorry I lied to you. I just want you to worry about us now. We have the money, everything's good. Things are in rotation. Trust me. Give me some fucking space, Tony. You Get your trust... head on straight. Yep, yeah, okay. All right. So you don't trust me then, huh? No, I don't trust you. Really? And when are you going to start trusting me then? Never. You get your head on straight. All right? Whatever you've got going on here, get rid of it. I don't know what's going on with you. I'll see you back at the house. Wait, you're my fucking ride. Hello? Hello? Are you... Son of a... You're just gonna leave? Yeah, I am. Get the fuck out of the way. Move. <laughs> you know, you're unbelievable, Jess. You know that we're in this together. You're just gonna drive away, huh? Yeah, fuck you.